kind of gutted it through today, how would you kind of describe your performance? Uh, I would agree with that. I did have a lot of my stuff that toward the beginning of the game, especially fastball, I felt like I struggled today with fastball, living to break the balls up, pulling to break the balls, just kind of had to find a way to fight out through that. I mean, now that people's got tape on you now, I mean, obviously there's things you could do earlier in the season that you got to be more careful with, but how are teams maybe attacking you differently at this point in the season than they were earlier in the year? Uh, I would say probably getting me early accounts because they, um, more times than not, I'm probably going to throw first pitch early plates and uh, taking that and getting on it. What's it kind of been like for you, I guess, in embracing that starter role, being that guy that, you know, there's been a few situations where it comes up and, you know, State either needs to salvage a series with you going on the, on the mound or, you know, looking to win a series or something along those lines? Uh, just going out there and giving my best every day. Um, trusting the guys behind me knowing I have one of the best defenses in college baseball. Um, it's pretty easy to pitch in this environment when the fans behind you and you got the other guys behind you making plays. You had a sequence there too where it's a first and third situation. You didn't give up anything and you got the big punch out there at the end. And we saw a little emotion from you there, but as a guy that's still kind of young and developing on a college level, how big is it to, to have that situation and then give them nothing? Uh, it kind of just helps you adapt to the occasion, rise to the occasion, you should say. Um, just <laughs> knowing that if you throw a ball over the plate, somebody's going to make a play. Um, kind of just trusting LT back there to make a pitch, and he's going to keep it. Um, How were you feeling kind of after those those six innings? I know Lamonis was kind of saying he didn't really want to push you being on that, you know, or one day fewer of what you normally get for rest. I mean, did you feel that at all? Were you, were you kind of sore by the time you finished? Uh, I could definitely tell it, but not much. Um, it's just kind of You don't get a pitcher's duel very often on a Sunday, you know, but uh, you know, today you did. I mean, when, when you've got another guy out there throwing up zeros, how does that maybe have you dig a little bit deeper? I mean, do you feel that at all, or do you pay attention to that? Uh, absolutely. You just got to go out there and try to match him, or not, if not be better. Um, he kind of pushes you to be, be better, and then he's probably going to take that just away from you as you are him. What did you say for Gonzalez today? What was, how, how, did, how was he affected? I mean, he was really good. He had a power sinker to both sides of the play, a change up and a slider. Um, it appeared like all of them tumbled really well, kept the ball down on the zone, great weak contact. Um, I would say he was pretty darn good. I think you forced about like six or seven flyouts with the wind blowing in today. Did that kind of affect how you're attacking the hitters? Uh, not really. Um, I wasn't really thinking about that. Um, but I kind of noticed it the first inning when the one ball went out to the opposite side. And you're a guy who's come out of the bullpen in the past. I guess what's kind of the, the mentality got to be like? I know some of your guys have struggled there, you know, in the back end trying to close out the games. Uh, I mean, I don't think it's a struggle. Um, I think that everybody knows their role. And, uh, it's just a matter of time is when they're going to come in and do their job and make pitches. Um, it's just kind of been our philosophy trying to come in get the first hitter out, get the two strikes as quick as possible. And uh, I feel like we've done a pretty good job of that this year. Brandon entered the rotation this weekend. Y'all had three really good quality starts. So what did you, uh, how did you think you guys did this weekend getting off the good starts? As a whole, I would say we did pretty good. Um, just getting ahead of hitters, putting a little pressure on them, getting out, stressing your defense. Um, when you do that, I mean, obviously the president struck out, the truck game struck out last night. Um, okay. Okay, what was your reaction to the final out? Uh, I was a little wound up, as you can tell. Um, oh, you're saying the, uh, the last one. I mean, I thought he was safe, but at the end of the day, it's not a goal. Can you explain the dude effect, and does it help your play, in your opinion? Uh, absolutely. The dude effect is just something you don't get often in many other stadiums. Um, you kind of just take that energy and put it to your your side of how you're going to attack the hitter. Bullpen has been up and down at times. Sometimes you've gotten really good relief, and other times you haven't. As a starter, do you feel any added pressure to have to throw up zeros? I know that's your job every time, but do you feel that sometimes, like, I, you know, I really can't afford to get a run up here? Uh, not really. Um, those guys in our pen are some of the best in the country, and they know, or you know, that they're going to come in and pick you up when you're down. Hey, you can with your SEC season now, and a long way to go, and a long way to What's kind of the man mindset now that you see what this team can do, what it needs to do, like where it stays in this moment? I think we're going to be fine. Um, just we 
got to come out on top on Fridays and Saturdays and then try to come out and sleep on the weekends. So then. Obviously, looking at the week ahead, you guys have Jackson State and you got four with Ole Miss. I mean, how, how important are these in-state games for you guys and, and kind of set the tone and, and wanting to be you know, the baseball school in the state? I mean, it's, it's one of the biggest college rivalries in baseball.